Hey everybody, welcome to Thursday's workout. Pizza. P it's a pizza missing one of the Z's. So if you find it, please re never mind. All right, so today's workout, Pizza, is four rounds, four time, of 30 dumbbell swings, a 30 foot single dumbbell overhead carry on the left arm, then 30 sit ups, and then 30 more feet of single dumbbell overhead carry on the right arm. So let's look at these movements. We'll come back, talk about strategy, and if you want, we can debate the name of this workout a little bit more. All right, so before we get into strategy, let's talk about modifications for today. If you have a kettlebell, great one. Go for the kettlebell swings and you can carry that weight overhead just as easy with the kettlebell. Make sure that the bell, the ball of the kettlebell is on the back side of your wrist. Don't hold it so that it's on the inside. That puts a ton of pressure on your thumb. Rather, have that handle sit there, hinge that wrist a little bit and let it put the weight in the palm of your hand. For your sit-ups, Let's do some sit-ups. Uh, you can anchor your feet if you need to. If you don't have an ab mat, shove them up the toes under a couch, something like that. Uh, for our dumbbell swings, if you have an odd object, you can always go a little bit wider with your feet and try to swing that way. If the head of your dumbbell is too big to hold that one head, like I showed you in the example, do 15 holding onto the handle with your right arm and 15 holding onto the handle with your left arm. Alternate as needed, just make sure you keep it even on both sides for your 30 swings. And then uh, back to that last carry, same mod as before. Uh, yeah, so those are our mods. All right, so how do we attack this one? This is a great opportunity that if you have a 30 foot distance to do your swings on one end, walk that dumbbell down 30 feet, do those sit-ups, pop the dumbbell overhead with the other arm, walk that 30 feet, and you're starting round two. So it might feel a little more manageable than doing a down and back with some of those overhead carries. The only thing you wanna break up in today's workout is those kettlebell swings. Pick a rep scheme, have a plan, attack it consistently to let yourself thrive on the overhead carries and the sit-ups where you can keep moving. A few second break on your kettlebell swings, if it keeps you moving on the other ones, will get you a better time in the long run. So if you have any questions about mods, Anything else that we've gone over, message a coach, get in a Zoom class if you can, see a coach live where we can help you out with specific mods right then and there on the spot. All right, so hit this one hard, have fun, and we will see you tomorrow for another workout.